Hi, my name is Emma El Agroubi. I'm a filmmaker that's a writer, producer and director from the United Arab Emirates. Um, I don't really think I would say anything. I think it's a little bit strange when you work in the film industry and you approach actors and you see them and then you start to talk. I mean, I can't fangirl over them if that's what you mean. Like, I don't know, you have to keep a certain level of professionalism. It's just always nice to have a chat if it's natural to do so. Um, but I think I, yeah, I mean, I guess everyone would just want them to they would probably try and find a way for them to work. I would probably try and find a way for them to work with me if I could, I suppose. Well, I'm a filmmaker, so definitely movie theater. Um, but I do enjoy Netflix as well. I think you could just consume more content, um, which is great for me because I love movies and TV and it's great for me. I don't think I'd swap my life with any filmmaker, to be honest. I'm quite happy being myself and I'm quite happy being the filmmaker that I am. Um, and I never really wish to switch it with anybody, so I just enjoy just being myself and making my own films. I think out of all of those, I would pick Mass Appeal because I always see myself as a filmmaker like of the people for the people. So I want to be able to make content that resonates and films that resonate. I want to be able to make films that resonate with audiences, so I think I would pick Mass Appeal. At the moment, my Instagram is really kicking, so I think probably Instagram. I used to be a very um, active Twitterer, tw tweet, tweet, tweeper, but I think maybe, yeah, Instagram for now. I can't really think of the last great movie I watched, but in isolation I have been watching a lot of Korean dramas. So Crash Landing on You and Itaewon Class was the last Korean drama I saw and I really enjoyed that uh, because Korean dramas have a really strong kind of character development and I've just been learning so much watching that. So I would say Itaewon Class, probably watch that. Oh, well, what haven't I been up to during self-isolation, I think. A lot of people can say that, you know, I've been quite busy, I've been quite active uh, on my social media, on my Instagram. Um, I created a YouTube channel. I made a short uh, stop motion animation, which is something I've always wanted to do. I've been writing quite a bit and just preparing for the future once we're all out of it.